Do you write Python code in Vim? In that case, you may want to check this one out. Here, I will show you how to install a plugin called Conquer of Completion, which enables features like auto completion, code navigation, function previews. As you can see in the slogan, they can make your Vim new Vim as smart as VS Code. You can also see here they have 18k of stars, which is a crazy high number. Typically, a popular Vim plugin has maybe 2k um, stars. Okay, so uh, COC is not specific for Python. In, in order to get Python support, you will have, uh, in, have to install another one called COC PyWrite. But uh, as long as you install COC, uh, install other plugins become very easy. So in the old times, uh, they use a COC Python plugin, but this one is already out of date. Okay, now let me show you um, the end, pro end result. So here I have a main function which imports some utility modules, some and other modules. So um, if I do Shift K, you can see this is a utility, and if I go to some function and do Shift K, it will show you the function signatures. And if I want to see even more, I can do GD to see the to go to jump to the function definition. And if I want to go back, I can do Control O. Uh, also, it can do uh, auto completions. For example, if we do YouTube, it will auto complete the uh, module name. And then you can directly select what function you want to use. And when you select, it will tell you the function signature. OK, you can also complete. Um, function name uh, in the current um, file or variable names in the current file let's say exclude old names you can also complete um, uh, english words say renaissance and it can auto correct for you as well um, and also you can include uh, function snippets uh, for example if main, it can give you snippets directly. OK, uh, another thing I use often is, uh, you can see here, um, uh, it is about uh, uh, f linting. It has automatic linting built in. You can see there are many errors. All those uh, red uh, signs are errors, and you can jump between them using using a square bracket G. And then they will tell you what the errors are. OK, that's about the, the showcase. Now let me show you how to install them. OK, so I don't want to mess up my uh, computer setting. So let's do the installation in a Docker container. Uh, let's bring up a standard uh, Ubuntu. OK, so this will uh, be a vanilla setting. And there won't be any uh, Vim even. Install git Vim curl. And after that, let's also get a, also let's get a repo for demonstration. Okay, well, we download. Let me show you another detail. Uh, okay. So suppose we don't load up any plugin. Uh, okay. So um, I'm going to show you uh, the gd command. This is actually, uh, which means go to definition. This actually comes with a uh, vanilla Vim. So you can see. Um, here, group name is a function defined in this file. So if I do gd, it will actually, let me open the, I, I just opened the, the, the keyboard uh, display. 
So if I do GD, it will actually go to the definition. Um, but if we go to a function that's not defined in the, in this file, if I do GD, it doesn't do anything. It will just get stuck there. So previously, the GD works because of the plugins. Oh, I should have done dash Y. I guess we just wait a little bit here. Okay, it's done. Uh, what do I do next? Oh, then we can install the COC. Yeah, it's right here. And then we need to install Vim plug. We can just do this one. Okay. So after Vim plug, we include these two lines. Uh, include this line. Vim RC. I think we also need some lines to begin and end the end that block. Oh yeah, example. So we need the begin. And end. Okay, let, let's do source and uh, plugin install. Oh, it's plugin install. Yes. Okay, now this one worked. Then we need to install PyWrite. PyWrite is uh, it's just uh, coc install coc install coc PyWrite. Okay, we can also install coc snippets. This is the one for the snippets auto completion. Uh, what else? Another one I install is COC words. Is it word or words? Let's try word. Words. Oh, maybe it's COC word. Yeah, COC word. Okay, oh I think then we need to install all the all the shortcuts. I think these are the shortcuts. Let's just copy everything. You can see here uh, it defines for example use tab to do complete auto completion. And uh, uh, the the, the uh, square G command to go uh, jump between the errors 
go to the definition, capital K to trigger the documentation, things like that. Okay, let's just copy it into here. Okay, now let's see if it works. Let's go to the guitar. Let's open up the main function. Okay, let's say import. See, it's already the the auto completion is here. OS dot path dot. Yeah, it's already working. And get repos. If we do shift K, and so it displays it. And if we do GD, it go there. Okay. So here, uh, you can see it's already working. All right, that's what I want to talk about today. Basically, it's the Vim setup for Python um, programmers. If you like content, uh, if you want to see more content like this, please like and subscribe. Thank you.